It's time for Dutch Oven Cooking with C-Dub. Here's your host, C.W. Butch Welch. We're going to make some pasta primavera. We've got some water boiling. They're getting ready to boil here for our pasta. And for our primavera, we're going to just start out here in the skillet with a little olive oil, probably about a quarter of a cup. And to that, we're going to add some uh, coarsely chopped garlic and some onions. We're going to get that sauteing. And these onions that we use, that's the only onion we use on our show, is the, the Hatco uh, Washington Sweet Onion. And we're going to have to play with our heat here because the wind's trying to blow our stove out. So we'll see if we can get everything cooked here a little bit. We've got another burner going here. And for our Primavera, we're going to toast some, uh, some pine nuts. And so we've got that little skillet going. And We've got a little heat. To go along with our Primavera, we're going to uh, throw in some Roma tomatoes that are coarsely chopped and uh, some basil. And we just tore this up. I kind of, you know, when I cook, I like, I guess it's a guy thing, you know, we like things in big chunks. My wife does the real nice, fancy, little tiny, petite things. And, so uh, we, uh, we argue about that in a good-natured way. And so we're just going to saute this, keep tossing our pine nuts a little bit. Oh, and they're starting to toast. In fact, when they smell done, they're done, so we'll just turn them off. Okay, that's good there. We don't need that. Also, with our Primavera, we're going to add... Uh, a little bit of uh, uh, a couple of cups of portobello mushrooms and to help this cook down we're going to use the same Chardonnay uh, from Columbia Crest that we used to poach our fish with so going to add uh, probably a half a cup something like that and uh, going to go in with a little salt and pepper not a lot of salt, but a little bit, a little pepper. And we're just going to keep tossing this. And when our uh, pasta is done and our water's just starting to boil, we're using a pound of rotini. And uh, we'll get that boiled up. And, and then we're just going to uh, dress our pasta with the primavera. So. Uh, We'll just keep working this down here, and it looks like it's going to be easier to do with two. Our pasta primavera, we've got our pasta done, and we're just going to spoon this out onto our pasta. We're just going to give that a toss or two, just dress that up a little bit. Get all those good juices and pine nuts. Need a bowl with a little higher sideboards here, but oh well, it's gonna work. Okay, and to finish that off with, we've got some uh, Parmesan cheese. We're gonna put that over the top and give that a toss.